Hello, and in this screencast for Apache Isis, I just want to improve the layout of this uh, customer order entity that I have that you can see is a bit of a mess at the moment. So to do that, I'm going to download the layout XML that's going to be created on the fly for us by the framework. Let's get hold of that file. Here it is, and let's go to the appropriate directory, which is this package here. Going to make sure the name is correct, layout.xml. All right, and then I'm going to stop the application and restart again because it needs to do that to pick up the existence of that layout file. And so with the app now running, let's um, double check. Here we are. Here's the app. Here's the page. So let's improve matters. So I'm going to create a new field set, uh, and this field set will be called metadata. And that's a, an important one, as we'll see in a second. I'm going to move the ID and I'm also going to move the data nucleus version. There's two versions of that field, uh, one's timestamp, one's for long. Only one of them will be shown depending upon whether the version is a timestamp or a long. Um, so let's just reload that and see what we get. Okay, so that's better. Um, and then the last thing I'm going to do is I'm going to actually remove these actions and we'll see what happens to them if I reload you can see that they jump down here. So by default, all of these four actions that are provided by the framework, these mix-ins, are automatically associated with the metadata field set. Okay, so that's it for this screencast. That's all I wanted to show. Hope that made sense. Give it a go.